Hi, Chandler Vessels here for ETSN with uh, John Tyler head coach Ricklin Holmes following his team's 22-10 victory over Lancaster here um, at Mesquite Memorial Stadium. Uh, coach, it was a great defensive effort for you guys tonight. Just what are your general thoughts about the way your team played? You know, defensively, we're, we're doing what we need to do to be a championship football team. Offensively, we're still doing what we need to do to be a championship football team. We just got to be consistent and make sure that we don't shoot ourselves in the foot to kill our drives. We had a couple of drives that we had going early in the game, and because of penalties, it stopped it and had to end up having to punt and put, putting the ball back into a dangerous offense hand. So, but our defense, they stood up. You know, it's something that Coach Anderson, he preaches to our defense week in and week out is that defense win championship. Offense, they sell tickets and score points. But at the end of the day, like I told them, if they don't put more points on the board than we do, we'll win this thing. Yeah. Frankie Sanchez pinned them in their, inside their own five twice, and then one was that safety, and then the other one was the fumble recovery. Just how huge was he tonight for you? Frankie Sanchez was the player of the game to me. Best play was back here. He had a pent deep, fumble snap, could have easily turned into a bad situation. But Frank is, Frank is a very smart, football-savvy kid. Uh, don't get me wrong, he's a great soccer player, great kicker. But as you see right now, he has really good football sense. And for him to get out of that situation and still stick to his guns and punt it the way that he punted it, it just lets you know probably sometime next year he's going to be a college football kicker. Yeah, and then uh, Keaton had that 73-yard uh, touchdown that sort of put things away for you. Just can you talk about what you saw in your perspective and how that sort of changed the game after after that play? You know, during the course of the game, you need something to spark your offense or your defense. Yeah. And, you know, that was something that helped us, you know, stay within our rhythm and let us know that, hey, we are doing things right. We just got to do a little bit better. Are you at all concerned about after the performance from your offense tonight, or was it something their defense was doing? What do you think caused the struggles tonight? It had a little bit to do with what their defense was doing, but it had a lot to do with what we were doing. You know, I felt like, you know, we didn't sustain blocks that we, that we normally would sustain, and I think a lot had to do with the speed of their defense, and that's something that we got to adjust better to. And then, you know, we had drives. We had great drives going, but once again, penalties that came from us, not them. All right, congratulations, Coach. Appreciate you. See y'all around.